Hello, I am Dr. Narendra Reddy. I am the consultant vascular surgeon at Columbia Asia Hospital Whitefield. I have been associated with this hospital right from the inception three years back. Non-healing ulcers are because of a variety of factors. Most of the time it is because of deficient nutrition or deficient blood supply coming down to the leg. Either it could be a diabetic reason or it could be an arterial blocks, blocks of the arteries or narrowing of the arteries coming down to the leg or it could be because of varicose veins itself, what is called as a venous ulcer. In each case, once we come to a diagnosis why the ulcer has formed, we can treat it specifically. If it's a diabetic, purely diabetic ulcer, but if there is any arterial component in that, it has to be treated simultaneously. Both the arterial system has to be revascularized by doing an angioplasty or a bypass. At the same time, the diabetic foot has to be debrided. All the necrotic tissue and the cellulitis tissue has to be taken out and allowing the wound to heal. If a patient comes with a chronic ulcer because of varicose veins or a venous ulcer, at the same time, we do the ulcer debridement. Patient might need a skin grafting to close the ulcer and the patient has got symptomatic varicose veins with the perforator incompetence. We treat the varicose veins at the same setting. 